In this video I will show you how you can connect the DaVinci Resolve Speed Editor keyboard to your computer to edit videos in DaVinci Resolve 18, 18.5 with the Bluetooth dongle, no cable, wireless. All you need is just a generic USB Bluetooth dongle. I have another video about the dongle so I will put a link in the description for that one. I think really any decent USB dongle will work as long as it has the, all the Bluetooth modes, modes low energy and uh, all the normal profiles. I don't know exactly which profile is used by this keyboard, but if the dongle works, you will know that. You connect the dongle to your Windows 11. Only 17%. Yeah, 17%. Oops. Okay. Time to charge it. Yeah, you have to plug it in with the USB if you want to charge it. It will not charge when it's connected through Bluetooth. It goes into sleep mode and the battery lasts actually a long time. Two weeks, maybe even one month. It depends how much you use it. If you don't use it, it goes into a deep sleep mode where it's basically off. And it will really last a long time. When you charge it, you might uh, you might have to restart DaVinci Resolve a few times. If the keyboard doesn't start, you press the cut and the smooth cut buttons below here. At the same time, count to five and you see those lights when they show up. It's all good. The DaVinci Resolve software has to be started when you do this. It's important that it, this only works with DaVinci Resolve with the editing program and color 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 grading how it's called yeah it only works with davinci resolve it would be nice if it works with other programs but yeah i only need it for this so battery level 18 percent pretty low still so the the usb bluetooth connection really just works you connect the the dongle from the Windows menu, from the network icon, you see the Bluetooth devices, you will see the keyboard, DaVinci keyboard, and uh, press connect and that's all. No pins, no anything. When you use it with a cable, you can use it, keep it like this, but I use it with the Bluetooth. I only use the cable now when I have to charge it and it's really rare once a month maybe we don't we don't use it that much this uh, keyboard but if we use it when we did use it uh, more often it was about every two weeks two three weeks the cable here when it's plugged in it's better to put it under the keyboard behind and like this you have the keyboard with the full full keys and all the shortcuts you need plus you have the DaVinci Resolve Speed Editor keyboard in front and the mouse on the right. I think it's a pretty good setup like this. The best thing about this Speed Editor keyboard is this jog wheel. It's amazing. It feels really like a very tight connection to the timeline on the screen. So any slight movement you make on the Speed Editor keyboard will translate directly in, on the screen like they, they are directly connected somehow it's really it's uh, working really well and this uh, really it makes things it's much easier and much more uh, convenient to edit videos it even makes it fun it just could go straight under on the keyboard You won't even see it anymore. No wire. No wire. If you do use it a lot, it's better to keep it plugged in so it's always charged. Maybe the response time when it's plugged in with the USB, it's a little faster. I didn't really notice any difference. To me, it's the same if it's through the Bluetooth or through the cable. 
but I'm sure there is a little small delay when it's going through Bluetooth that maybe I didn't notice but maybe you will notice it it's good to have the options the cable the USB cable connection is always available there but I prefer the Bluetooth really it's so much more convenient it's really so easy to just put the keyboard away when you don't need it and put it back when you need it even you can edit from your couch thanks for watching and let me know if you have any questions about the USB cable this 90 degree uh, mean small profile how it's called low profile cable or the USB dongle the Bluetooth how to connect it through Bluetooth or the keyboard or DaVinci Resolve any question you might have let me know in the comment section below and if you have this keyboard let me know which is your favorite shortcut on it favorite button or buttons